sunny day, Chelsea was baking outside her clubhouse when along came Elsie. Hello Elsie and Annie! Hello Chelsea! What are you up to Chelsea? Oh, I'm baking cupcakes! Would you like some? Yes please! Mmm, cupcakes are yummy! Do you want to come and play with us on the swings? Yeah, I'd really like that. I'll just put my cupcakes in the oven and I'll be out in two minutes. Okay, we'll meet you there in a bit. Do you like my cupcakes? I have to bake them before I decorate them later. Now what was the temperature again? Oh yeah, 15 minutes at 180 fan. <laughs> I'm coming Elsie and Annie. I really like your scooter, Elsie. Thank you, Mummy got it for me for my birthday. Oh yeah, I remember, I was there. <laughs> Do you want to have a go on my scooter later? Yeah, I'd love to, but you have to teach me how to ride it. It's easy, even I can do it. Come on, I'll race you to the swings. I'm going to get there first, no me. Watch out, here I come. Yay, that was so much fun. I'm going to push you so high, you're going to fall in the sky. <laughs> stop, stop. <laughs> if she falls in the sky, who's going to push you? Oh yeah, let me push it a bit slower. <laughs> Something? Um, yeah, did someone do a fart? I didn't! I didn't either! Well, what is it then? It kind of smells like burning! <gasps> oh no! It's the clubhouse! It's on fire! Oh no! Somebody get an adult quick! Barbie! Barbie! The clubhouse is on fire!
We can always get another clubhouse, but we can't get another Chelsea, Elsie or Annie. I guess you're right. Thank you for saving us. You're welcome. Now girls, how did the fire start? Oh, it was my fault. I made Chelsea play with me and she forgot the muffins in the oven. It was an accident, but you still have to be more careful in the future so it doesn't happen again. Yes, next time you want to bake something, Chelsea, you have to let me know so I can supervise you. We're sorry, we're never going to do it again. Yeah, we're so, so, so extra sorry. Can I try your fire hat on? Sure, why not? Does it suit me? It's very, very heavy. <laughs> Chelsea, you look so good in that fire hat. Let me give you a little lesson about fire safety. First, never play with matches. Never leave the oven unattended. Yeah, I'm never ever going to do that again, I promise. If your clothing catches fire, you should stop, drop and roll. And if you're ever in a burning building, get out immediately and call the fire brigade. Yeah, that's great advice. I love that noise the fire truck makes. Why don't you press that big black button over there? Okay. That noise is so everyone knows we're coming. Yeah, yeah, that was so great. Oh, wow. Yeah, the crane's back. Mission accomplished. Would you like to stay and have some tea? Oh, I'd love to, but I've got another job to go and see. I think there's a cat stuck in the tree. Thank you for teaching us all about fire safety. You're welcome, and make sure you stay safe. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe. See you next time. Bye. If I don't get this pony, I'm going to break this toy shop. Toy-tastic! Elsie and Annie go to Barbie's toy shop. Yay, yay! We're at the toy shop! I'm so happy! It's a world full of toys! Hello there! Welcome to Barbie's toy shop! I see you found the toy shop, girls! Yeah, they couldn't get here fast enough! I can't believe we're finally here at the toy shop! Yeah, this is the most magicalest place in the whole world! We have all the toys you could wish for in store! There's not one toy we don't stock! Our girls finally finished their smiley face chart for good behaviour, so we're getting them a toy as a reward! Oh wow, well done girls! Yeah, I've been so very extra good lately, Mummy says she's so proud of me! Remember, Annie, you have to keep being good even after you get your toy. Okay, girls, you've got ten minutes to have a look around to see what you want. Try and find something you won't get bored of so quickly. Come on, let's find the toy we want to take home. Oh, it's such a hard decision. Don't worry, I'll help you, Annie. At Barbie's Toy Shop, there's a toy for everyone. Just let me know if you need any help. We will do. Thank you. Make sure you have a good look round before you decide. Wow, we there are so many toys. My eyes are dizzy. Let's see what we can get. Elsie, and then you always lose them. A bucket and spade, so 
we can make sandcastles at the seaside. What do you think, Annie? Don't get the bucket and spade, choose something more fantastic. Excuse me, Miss Shop Lady, can you get me that mermaid from up there, please? Sure, of course I can. Oh, wow, she's so pretty. Does she talk? Um, no, I don't think she can talk. Oh, okay then. Does she swim all by herself? No, she doesn't swim by herself, but you can swim with her. What's the point of that then? I don't think I want this fair maid, Miss Shop Lady. Sorry. No problem. Maybe there's something else that you'll like. Are you sure this is the toy you want, Elsie? Yeah, yeah, I love it so much, I promise! Okay then, this is the one that we'll get. Oh, thank you, Mommy, thank you so much! I love you! Mwah! Aren't you so adorable? Ooh, look at this pony, she's so pretty! Mommy, I want this pony, please! But Annie, you've already got pony just like that one. No, no, this one's got rainbow hair. Can't you see? Yes, Annie, but there's no space in your room for two ponies. I don't care. I want this pony. If I don't get it, I'm going to get so, so mad. Annie, watch yourself. No, never. I don't care. I said no, Annie, and that's on like this. No, no, I don't want anything else. I want, the, I want the pony with the rainbow hair. I want the rainbow pony. <laughs> if I don't get this pony, I'm going to break this toy shop. I hate everything. No, no, I don't want to. No, never. Oh no, there, there. Don't get mad. I'm sure we'll find you something. Annie, this is your final warning. No toys for today. Do you understand? No, I don't understand. I don't want anything. I don't even care. No. Annie, stop it. Now your mommy's not going to get you any toys. Look what you've done. I don't care. Go away. I don't like you. Ugh, she never learns. Look what I've got in my hand. Do you know what this is? Yeah, it's a balloon. And do you know who this is for? Uh, I don't know. Is it for me? If you stop crying, I'll give you this balloon. Oh, I don't know. I'm really sad. Well, your mummy said you can't get the pony today, but you can take away this balloon and come back another time. Okay, maybe then. Oh, yay! I got a balloon too! But I still really, really, really want that pony! Annie, if you apologise to everybody, you can share my toy. I'm sorry I had a tantrum, everyone. Uh, sometimes I get sad and out of control, but I promise I'm never going to do it again. I accept your apology, Annie. We all make mistakes from time to time. And I'm so sorry for what happened to your shop. I'll help you clean up. Oh, don't worry. I'll get everything back in order in no time. Mommy, can I get the pony now because I apologise? No, Annie, that's out of the question. No toys for today. And now you have to start your smiley face chat all again. Come on, girls, let's go home. I think I need a lie down. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe. See you next time. Bye. I think I'm going to melt. At least we have ice creams to cool off. 
Elsie. I'm afraid we can't. There's a hose pipe ban. What's the hose pipe ban? It means you're not allowed to use any extra water apart from cleaning, drinking and washing. Does that mean we can't play in the water? But how are we supposed to cool down? It's because the sun's really strong and it hasn't rained recently. So if everybody filled up their pool and watered all their plants, then there'd be a water shortage and that would be a disaster. Oh my goodness, that's crazy! I guess it makes sense, but I really miss playing in the pool. When the hosepipe ban ends, I promise we'll go swimming. Hey girls, I've got a great fun idea we can do instead. Oh really, Auntie Anna? Yes, but it's going to be a surprise, so you two have to go indoors until we call you. What is it, Mommy? You can tell me. Sorry, Annie, it will ruin the surprise. Now run along inside and I'll call you when I'm done. Oh, that sounds exciting. Come on, Annie, let's go. Just because there's a hosepipe ban doesn't mean we can't use the pool. Anna, I have no idea what you're up to. I hope Elsie and Annie aren't peeking. The girls are inside watching TV until we call them to come out. But I still don't know what you're planning. I'm planning something they'll never forget for the rest of their lives. And I'm going to need your help. Tell me what I have to do and I'll do it. I'm going to make a ball pit. Isn't that such a great idea? This is going to be so much fun. I'm so excited already. The first two are in. Just another 998 to go. <laughs> Come on, help me fill up the pool. Here comes a pink one. Yay, I'll get some more. Come on Elsa, this is going to take forever if you do it one by one. Yay, it's filling up nicely. Keep going, keep going. Hey, this is fun for us too. <laughs> We're nearly there. A few more balls. Oh, that got my head. When they see this. I think we filled it up as much as we can. Yeah, I think so too. Let's call them in and see what they think. They're going to think that we're the best mommies ever, that's what. <laughs> I love spoiling them, they deserve it. Girls, come outside and see your surprise. like your surprise then? We absolutely love it! You're the best mommy! I love you so much! Come on girls, what are you waiting for? Jump in! Yay, let's go! Come on, yay! Okay Annie, you can slide down now! Who threw that? <laughs> 
<laughs> I want to jump in the ball pit every day! Yeah, me too! <laughs> Yay! Woohoo! Don't forget to press the subscribe button! It's the red one! See you next time! Good. Annie, they're dog biscuits. You're not supposed to eat them. Toy Tastic. Oh, Mommy, look, they opened a new pet shop. So they have. Shall we have a little look inside? Yes, please. I love animals. Me too. Come on, let's go. Animals. Mommy, can I get a puppy? Please, please, please. Oh, I don't know about that. We're just having a look, remember? But Mommy, I need a puppy. I need one. Getting a puppy is a big decision. You have to feed them, wash them and take them for walks. It's lots of responsibility. I know they're not toys, Mommy. I can do it. I know I can. Oh, there you are! We've been looking for you! We were just having a look at the new pet shop. We're thinking about getting a puppy. Oh, wow, really? That's exciting! Yay, Mummy's getting me a puppy! I haven't promised anything yet. We were just having a look. Remember? I guess there's no harm in looking. These puppies are too cute. I can't handle it. Can we ride on them? No, Annie, you can't ride on them. They're not ponies. What's the point of getting a pet if you can't ride it? Elsie, I think they're trying to talk to me. I think they're excited. Look, I can bark too. Woof, woof, woof. today. We just wanted to have a look at some puppies. She means she wants to get a puppy. No worries, we have everything you need to get a new pet. Our shop has only the finest premier breeds around. We also vaccinate them, train them and sell accessories to help you settle in. Which means you can go home with your pet today with everything you need. Oh, isn't that wonderful, Anna? I don't know who's more excited, you or the kids. <laughs> oh, look how gorgeous this poodle is. <laughs> Stroke him, Mummy, and see how soft he is. Their fur is so soft. I could stroke them all day. Mommy, I want this white puppy. Can we take him home? 
Are you sure you want this one? Yes, I want him so, so much. When we saw each other, it was love at first sight. <laughs> well, if it's true love, I guess we'll have to take him home. Yay, yay, we're going to get a puppy. I'm so happy. Come on, little pup. You're coming home with us. Have you chosen your pet? Yes, we'd love to take this poodle home. Great choice. Would you like to purchase any accessories for him? Um, I think we'll have that blue jacket and some grooming equipment. Great choice, madam. Would you also like some pet perfume? Yes, please. Perfect. We also give a complimentary bath to all our new pet owners. Oh, how lovely! We recommend you use our Poodle Shampoo to keep their fur perfect. Ooh, bubbly! Come on, little Poodle, get in the bath. This one really likes having his fur brushed. Can I help? Of course you can. we go, all nice and dry. Can I put on his jacket for him? Yes, go ahead. Isn't he the best looking poodle you've ever seen? He sure is. I can't wait to play fetch with him. I'll just pack the rest of your stuff and then you can take him home. This is the best day of my life ever. I'm even more excited than you. We're going to have so much fun together. Here kitty kitty. Meow, meow, meow. Annie, stop chasing the cat. <laughs> this is my toy and you can't have it little kitty. Meow, meow, meow. Annie, leave the cat alone and come here at once. <laughs> meow, meow, meow. Is everything okay madam? I don't think we're ready to get a cat, but we'll get this toy. Certainly. Shall I pack it with the others? Yes, please. Look, puppy, we got you all these things. I think we've got everything we need. I'll just put everything in this bag and then you can take him home. Oh, mommy, I love my new poodle pet so much. What are you going to call him, Elsie? Yes, you should choose a name for him. I think I'm going to call him Pongo, Pongo the Poodle. Woof, woof, woof. And I'm going to look after him so much. Well, that's a lovely name. Come on, let's take him home. Yay, Pongo, let's go home. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe. Bye. Toy-tastic!